A 58-year-old male patient presents reporting four months of recurring abdominal pain. A hypervascular lesion is detected in the liver, but gastrointestinal endoscopies and diagnostic laparoscopy revealed no significant findings. Capsule endoscopy was performed after obtaining informed consent of the patient and discussing possible capsule retention. Retained secretions indicate a stenosis of the distal small bowel. Shortly thereafter, a tumor is visualized. The video sequence is repeated to outline the typical features of this small bowel tumor. Distorted mucosal vessels on an intraluminal protruding lesion are indicative of a neoplasm of the small bowel. The capsule endoscope is retained before the tumor, bouncing back into the proximal small bowel and reveals normal mucosal surface. Elective surgical resection of the small bowel tumor was scheduled for a few days later. We refrained from doing balloon enteroscopy or any other diagnostic test because of the definitive capsule endoscopy findings. Capsule retrieval did not seem necessary. The patient returned to the hospital early with acute abdominal pain. Plain abdominal x-ray was performed. Plain x-ray exam indicates mechanical small bowel obstruction and the capsule endoscope is retained at the right lower quadrant. During urgent laparotomy, the tumor was removed from the distal small bowel. A highly differentiated neuroendocrine tumor was found at histopathological examination.